we are going to talk about partial correlation analysis, its concept, its interpretation, and reporting. Now, what is partial correlation? Bivariate correlation, as discussed in one of the previous videos, provide correlation between two variables. The resulting value might be affected by other variables in the study. Now, you might need to control to the effect of another variable on your correlation. So partial correlation allows you to control the effect of an additional variable by statistically removing the influence of this variable. You can get a clearer and more accurate indication of the relationship between the two variables. Now what happens if you do not control the variable? It may be so that the correlation between the two variables is due to another variable that overestimates the correlation between the two variables. Controlling the variable may lower the correlation between the two variables of interest. Now, how do you run this correlation in SPSS? Now, what we are going to do is we are going to run a correlation between servant leadership and life satisfaction by controlling for the experience that people have or the time since they have been working on the job. Now, you go to correlate and then you select partial and what we are interested in is servant leadership and life satisfaction and we are controlling for the experience we go to options and we select zero order correlation that is normal correlation without the controlling variable continue and okay now here are our results the first section shows this is none, no control variable. And when there is no control variable, the relationship between servant leadership and life satisfaction, the correlation coefficient is 0 0.526. Now, what is this? This is the correlation of servant leadership with experience. And we see that there is a negative correlation. This means that with higher uh, experience or increase in experience, the perception about the viability of servant leadership actually decreases by minus 1.145. Now, this is obviously significant because the value is less than 0 0.05, the p-value. Now, when controlling for this variable experience, the relationship between servant leadership and life satisfaction is decreased. The correlation coefficient now is 0 0.511 which was previously 0.526. Now, when you control for experience, the correlation coefficient or the strength of relationship actually decreases. Now, how do you report the results for partial correlation analysis? In order to do that, here is the template. Now, the problem is that we want to investigate the relationship between servant leadership and life satisfaction. The hypothesis is there is a significant relationship between servant leadership and life satisfaction. Now, in order to report partial correlation, what you can do is you can write it like this. The relationship between servant leadership and life satisfaction, LS, was explored using partial correlation while controlling for experience. There was a moderate positive partial correlation between SL and LS, controlling for experience. Now, when you control for it, the R value is 0 0.511. So what you do is you just simply write 0 0.511. N is the sample size. Let's see what the sample size is. It's 218, 218 respondents. And the P value was less than 0 0.001. Now with an increase, in this case, the correlation is positive. So we use the word increase. With increase in SL significantly related to higher life satisfaction. Now, an inspection of zero order correlation, one with no controlling variable, the value of R was 0.526. Now, this suggests that controlling for experience had a very little effect on the strength of relationship between these two variables because previously it was moderately positive with the 
controlling variable and without the controlling variable it was 0.526 so there is very little difference however in your case when you control for different variables this might not be the case so it's always a good idea to have controlling variables when expressing the relationship in order to have a true and accurate and clear picture of relationship between variables i hope this video would have helped you understand the relationship between servant leadership life satisfaction through partial correlation Thank you very much.